Oh, this is Wilcole 100 returning once again with Tropico 4 in my quest to produce as much Swiss bank account money as possible. Today we are doing the mission called Import Ant Business. I am one step closer to achieving my plans of turning Tropico into a superpower. Now I need to establish a strong economy. And the island he has for it is a barren wasteland without much in the way of research. I don't know how this is actually a good place to build, but it is located close to international traders. This is the prime candidate to become the heart of Tropico's industry. So obviously this is going to be an industry mission. So, um, our, our lovely uh, Generalismo will uh, run our country. We definitely don't want to be a travel agent, because, well, we're going into industry. Self-made man would be good for factory profits, but also Silver Spoon would be, is also really good because of the 10% market production. And the starting money would help us get off the ground quicker. And we could also go a professor, which would have a faster education, which allows us to get more of those lovely uh, high school graduated factory workers quicker, and also makes them train up faster. Uh, pop singer would would have been interesting in the previous one. Um, oil tycoon. No, we, we don't have much of local resources. Uh, this would raise the building costs, but lower pollution. Um, well, this 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 is kind of okay because then I'd get more Swiss banking out money, but then I'd have less returns on uh, my actual investments, which would make the game harder. Uh, again, this is this is like professor, except it's a USSR based professor. Miner, we don't have anything in the mine. Um, fast, th th this is the uh, intellectualist author. How are you? So th this is the U.S. professor version. So just straight up professor. Um, Journalismo. Right, you need soldiers. Farmer. No farms. Developer. Uh, reduce building costs, which sadly would actually reduce the amount of money I get in from our Barrett building permits, which I don't want to do. I want 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 our factories to be. So this would be a good choice because rum is is rum. We could easily set up a couple uh, rum or a couple sugar plantations and and start turning it into rum. That, that's very tempting. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Booze Baron. Might not be the best choice, but I'm, I'm doing it. We're going Booze Baron. Uh, extra Liberty. Can't do a religious appointment because I suck to Booze Baron. Uh, same thing for uh, Family Values. Booze Baron. That so doesn't fit. Uh, coup. I don't think the military, military building is cheaper, but I don't need military buildings to be cheaper. Installing with the CIA would be uh, interesting. So I'll offer uh, treasury a year. Uh, capitalist, 20% factory work production is probably the best. Yeah, let's go elected as a capitalist. Uh, there is high democratic uh, expectations though, so I will have to vote instead of fraud. Vote instead of fraud. Um, we don't need social bullying anymore because, again, we're not doing tourism. Let's go with, uh, we can go with the administrator, which, we can go with the administrator, no, we want to keep the buildings, like, normal cost, preferably. What we want, oh, so we could do, uh, an early cement factory for increased construction speed, and also it provides, a the factory, it produces money. Let's go with the uh, first cement factory cost costs no money. I'm gonna give us an early factory job. I'm an environmentalist. I'm an environmentalist. I am for clean air. Okay, the contract. Cloudy partner, I have prepared a contract according to the terms discussed. In exchange for 20% of the shares of the island of Yarmo, I have financed operations with 2,000. And some of my precious employees will boost the island's workforce. They may be a little jaded and use luxuries, used to luxuries of a big life. But they are well educated to prove useful, of course. The most crucial aspect at your disposal will be my invaluable expertise. Listen to me and you will go far by now. Okay, so first thing, pause. Let's uh, get some stuff planted. Okay. Uh, industry. Our cement pet factory for free. We obviously want the cement factory because it's free. You get put down. And then Obviously, because we're going into lots of factory jobs, we're going to need a college right off the bat. Uh, how many free jobs slash unemployed do we have? We already have, we have one unemployed, eight free jobs. 
So we've actually got a got a worker shortage right in the back. So we got a couple cabin ranches. Now let, let's look at our uh, farming overlay quickly. Um, bad for corn. Unless we go up here. Uh, can't do bananas. Bananas are, are SOL. A uh, little bit for papaya up here. Uh, no pineapple. No coffee. No tobacco. It's like okay-ish. Oh, we got we got nice sugar though. So if I wanted, yeah, booze baron. Booze baron is a good one because we can do uh, sugar plantations. Put up like three or four sugar plantations. Okay. So now we know uh, what we're gonna do. Now what what's what is it far as ranching? No, wrong wrong uh, wrong overlay. Condition. No. no, 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 no. I want ranching. I want conditions. No, I'm just gonna have to go in here. Food. Uh, ranch. Okay, so uh, starting area is kind of okay for ranching. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna put in. Two more uh, cattle ranches to serve as a food source. If I can get um, position. There we go. And uh, that will serve as a start. Let's get this uh, rolling. I'm also going to immediately kick these into uh, smoked beef so they produce more expensive smoked, smoked beef on export. Okay, how much does a plantation cost? Just check that before I start throwing plantations out. Okay, yeah, so I can I can afford sugar plantations. Oops. Sugar. Sugar. Sugar, and let's go one more sugar. Put a little bit of space between it and the next one for the road. And I put a little bit too much space. Okay, so we got stuff to be built. Uh, okay, so we got a mission. In order to compensate for the lack of our resources and we must rely on imports, the first step of our plan would be to establish a cons customs office. With this building in place, we can increase the price of our exports or lower the cost of our imports. Once the first stage of our plan is complete, I will pull some strings and negotiate for the lower import price of the raw materials this time. This should give our industry the boost it needs to get off the ground. Construction workers showing up at the cement factory. Which will provide a total of six high school jobs. We've got high school educating some uh, teachers for itself. Fair left and no exports on board. Arrived with 15 new marines. We'll all go work in our sugar plantations. Each of which have uh, eight workers. So, so let's go put put another one down. That'll be a total of uh, forty plant or er, forty plantation workers. That should supply nice, uh, probably supply about five uh, rum distilleries. Rum, 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 rum. So the religious won't be happy, but oh well. My bank account will be happy. So I'm not really worried about the customs office because right now it's just going to be lowering the raw resource prices, uh, which I'm not using. And I can wait until the treasury thing kicks in until I start building factories. I'll decrease the cost of my factories a lot.
or it can be used to spent to be spent on factories. So let's get our uh, primary production building zip, so we get a nice income slash food income because well, these cattle ranches produce food. Smokehouse, so any export or any excess gets uh, exported. Uh, do you have more workers for him? I'd like more workers. Eight new workers. So we have four unemployed, eight free job positions. Ah, uh, yes, the cement factory producing cement, which increases the rate of our builders building. No, actually, I want the cattle ranch to be completed. I want the, want the place where El Presidente is standing to be completed, so El Presidente can move on to the next place. Ah, Colonial Fork. Well, we're not going to tourism, so a dungeon would be nice. Of course, I might want uh, some police to fill the dungeon first. Construction workers, get to the construction job, please. Yeah, three new immigrants. Uh, so we actually have all our currently constructed jobs fulfilled or filled, which is uh, good and bad. It's good because well, we uh, have our employment. We have all our jobs working at maximum efficiency. It's bad, but because we're going to be keeping continuously getting more people. Okay, high schools where you get maximum efficiency, which will minimize the ball neck created by our uh, factories when you know lots of uh, people trying to get into factory jobs. Quick build the ministry. Economy, yes. College graduate. Uh, edge, yeah, I can hold off because we need a teacher. And then talk foreign affairs, same thing. Let's put a defense guy in. Exceptional intelligence. Okay, um... I'm trying to think. What did I just think about? Um, economy. Oh, yes. Market. So that we can import food if our cow farms aren't producing enough food. Okay, so now we have free jobs. <laughs> we have places for people to work. So come to the island to work. Or else. Uh, crime safety. Yeah, the capitalists complaining about crime safety. Oh yes, I also might want a foreign affairs guy, why the uh, communists don't hate me yet. Keyword yet. They probably will, because I'll be running behind in houses and healthcare forever. Oh no, we're losing builders because we have more people transferring to other jobs. Just just raise the uh, job quality a little bit. I don't know why they're doing it in this order, but they're doing it in this order. Okay. All right, the marketplace is up. I'm gonna give this uh, food imports. And, oh, the economy minister has arrived, so we'll activate the building permits. Uh, foreign affairs has arrived as well. That's good. Foreign affairs. Before the uh, USSR gets pissy with us, let's get our tenement achievement. That'll make uh, housing later be cheaper. Yes, it's, it's best to do that as quickly as possible so that the uh, 
the USSR is happy with you before, or so that you have the cheaper buildings to make the USSR happy with you. That otherwise you would need the cheaper, you need the buildings constructed first to build. Now it's the cement factory turning out cement. And we imported more value of goods than we exported. Oh no, actually, never mind. I'm just like the cuckoo. We, we exported 800 more than we imported. And we're only importing food, so that's good. So that means enough food was brought to the marketplace to fill it up. Uh, probably going to be importing lots, so set that to no limit. Uh, demand for healthcare. Uh, probably demand for church too, but that hasn't been fulfilled. Functions. Yes, the religious are kind of pissy about no church. And the fact that no one moves right. The father might be happy about the booze, but the church, as in the whole, is not. <laughs> Well, let's go ahead and, even if the church isn't very well staffed, the church will um, appease the uh, religious faction a little bit. Industry, uh, we are going to be running lots of rum, so let's, let's get that blueprint right now. Some people protest peacefully against the government. What are you protesting about? The fact that you don't have any houses? What the heck is rain? I'd prefer if you were only protesting about the rain, because then I can pretend like I can't do anything about it. Okay, economy. We still have... Okay, we still have job positions. This is good. We want, uh, we want job positions constantly. Uh, people keep moving and uh, don't complain about lack of jobs. Ah yes, freighter exported 25,000 worth of tropical goods. Probably almost all sugar. Uh, so I think, it, I think it's time to start refining the sugar. But first, let's uh, get this custom house queued. Welfare and economy. Um, where's the custom house? Not in here. Okay. Industry? No. Why would we be in industry? Fracture. All right. I've misplaced the building. Give, give me a moment while I try to figure out where this building is. Uh, plantation. I might want to put some smugglers in. <laughs> smugglers. Attainment. Why would we be in attainment? Government. Why would we be in government? That's not office. Information office, foreign office, armory. Place, agriculture. Teamsters office now. So it definitely is a custom office. I know that building exists. I just am having a, having a bad day trying to find it. Now, cool. Garbage shop, no. Government. Fiction office. Oh, there's the customer house. I probably skimmed over it a couple times. Sorry if you find that a little on the annoying side. I was not trying to do it intentionally. Simulate the exports, because initially that's probably probably what we're going to be doing mostly. Uh, get our first rum distillery out. Customs House is on. Uh, you want canned coffee. It's time to start building an industry powerhouse partner. Construct a cannery and enable the import of coffee from the building panel or import section of the Almanac. Canned coffee is very popular in the US 
uh, coffee shops in the moment. Well, that, that'll be uh, delayed because I'm building rum. Tropico will be known for its rum. Alright, raw resources decrease, commodity price of canned coffee has increased by 50%. We have to simulate exports, which will uh, increase uh, export values, which is good. Okay, the first of our rum distilleries is up. Dock, uh, ship has docked many too many organs. Too many shacks. Oh well, deal with it. Putting in a uh, road, so I know roughly how much space I need to leave for the uh, these two farms. I can put a row along here, and I can put everything this side. Expert, freighter exported uh, goods, which is good. Additional docks. Build an initial dock. Okay. I can agree with this suggestion. Infrastructure. Dock. And a dock. So we'll put the dock on this beach. So I'll get all these uh, rum distilleries up and running, and then I'll upgrade them all to Spice Drum. That'll provide the backbone for our industrial economy. No wonder where. Which would be bad if I was doing what he was telling me to do, which was import coffee. Or Im import coffee can. Because then there wouldn't be any imports coming in on the next boat. Unless the next boat just happened to be exporting a lot at the same time as well. We have a, uh, a worker shortage. <laughs> uh, 77 free job positions. Yes. Just, just a little bit of a worker shortage. Um, want to do me a favor, partner? Recently I've been busy with a little restructuring in my company. Unfortunately, some of these serious work reunions are not allowed to straight up fire people I want. Well, I have to decided to relocate them to a position that better suit their talent. I'm certain that El Presidente would be happy to welcome 40 not so bright people to his ever growing workforce. Uh, I won't take your lazy employees, make the nationalists happy, or bring them on more than the merrier. Uh, well, I have a job shortage of 77, or I, I have a job surplus of 77 jobs, so um, sure, I'll, I'll take your unemployed that fulfill my employment. And even though I know from a previous playthrough that that causes other negative events to happen. But uh, I have empty factories. If, if this is not good, the factories, they must be filled. Hopefully the completion of that rum distillery will count for that cost. Yes, it did. <laughs> it's like, well, I'm, I'm halfway through building one, so I'll accept the quest in hopes that it'll uh, be happy. Okay, you want a childhood museum. Uh, just so we have some ed entertainment on the island, and so that you don't bother me about it, I will build you your childhood museum. 
I'm even gonna quick build it and get it done pretty quickly. Uh, intelligent reports that subversive elements might be taking violent action against the government. Eh, subversive elements. I like subversive elements. They subvert things. Yeah, let's also come in here. Let's get an industry. And he wants us to start canning things. So let's, let's go ahead and we'll get one cannery. And we'll allow imports. Yes, allow imports. Allow imports. Even though we shouldn't need any sugar imports, we'll allow. And we'll get one flavoring facility in for the moment. Freighter exported, freighter imported. Where those, where's those 40 people? We've got uh, free job positions that need filling. I think they've already arrived too, which is kind of sad. I've still got 60 free job positions. The packing house didn't ask, but it improve uh, efficiency of the factory by 30%. Poor healthcare was responsible for four deaths last year. Uh, I might have to put a university in at some, or, or not a university, a college in at some point, so I can uh, have some healthcare professions, professionals. No, oh, no, we're in the red, and there's a rubble threat. Of course, there's a rubble threat. And a coop threat. Which, with respect, actions. Why are the military pissed with me? Uh, they want more army. Probably because they aren't numbered by the rebels. Who are you? Yeah, threat level medium. It's two rebels, four soldiers. Okay, so I'm not particularly worried yet. Foreign relations have deteriorated again, over our national debt, which isn't good. Uh, Probably need to get more teamsters to hold more stuff to the docks. And that requires having more money. Uh, Tropican armies, you want five soldiers. Well, uh, we have a current cash flow issue, so that is not occurring. Infrastructure, let, let's get another uh, teamsters office. Shove it in right there. Uh, elections with a speech. Uh, again, I haven't been building houses, so we got a housing issue. Uh, which faction do I want to approve? Peas the most. Uh, looks like the communists. And uh, let's get a sufficient army because I can actually fulfill that. Possibly. Okay, the importance of the upcoming elections has brought me before you. We are one step closer to goals. Victory is always upon us, not really. But we must still push forward. What sort of exports do you want? You want... Rum. Yes. I, I will I'll hit the accept button simply because it's already going to be fulfilled by the fact that I have five rum distilleries. Yes, there are problems. There will always be problems, especially in the current economic situation. The sax the saxency about which I hear so much these days is one of them. Yes, we have a housing problem. And it will be resolved, as will all others in time, as the global economy stabilizes. I'm not actually so sure about that, but um the uh the unemployment situation is definitely never going to be a problem. Okay, so we got goods on the docks, so we should be running positive now.
Again, we still got a massive worker shortage. 75 free job positions. Now let's go ahead and I'm gonna go into government very quickly. We need an immigration office and we need to turn immigration up. Turn it down to maximum. Uh, slackers on strike. Uh, you must excuse my lazy employees. It seems that their sudden career changes is proof. That's the wrong picture. It should be uh, the uh, Texan guy. Career changes proved detrimental in the motivation. Now they are threatening to paralyze the eye of the economy with frequent strikes. You can appeal to these ungrateful lackers by building a cosmic pen, which will remind them of their careful life in the big city. A cruder, but still effective method will be to turn the old fort located in island to a dungeon. People will think twice before they slack off. Find me a dragon statue for my new dungeon. Uh, people are growing restless, President Day. Luckily, there's an old colonial fort already situated in Alley. It can easily be converted into a murky dungeon. I've already arranged for a dragon statue delivered from China, so that our dungeon can even look more intimidating. This will surely strike fear and still respect in the minds of our lazy citizens for the current strikes. You. Dungeon mode. Okay, um, government. Let's get an armory up so the military is a little happy with us. And then hope I can fill all my uh, my job positions, or more of my job positions, as the high school is running at maximum overtime to uh, turn lowly farmers into mighty distillers. So we have our tropic dungeon. Of course, we don't have any police, so no one's going to get thrown in dungeon. Sadly, our foreign uh, affairs minister died. There is no need for fraud. We were already winning this election. Oh, you complaining about uh, superpowers clash? President Day, there's a clash in the third world between armed forces supporting the U.S. and USSR. Who shot? Or what shall we do? Unfortunately, we've been put on the spot. Can't be usual. We should pick a side soon. What is our stance in the matter? Um, let, let's blame Russia. Uh, return of the suckers. President Day, why is it good for nothing people? We're getting used to a good life now and are demanding luxury accommodations. Perhaps if we build, manage to build at least five mansions, people will be motivated to work harder. On the other hand, there's more than one way it's going to catch, and that applies to Tropicans too. Instead of complying with the unrealistic demands of the late citizens, show them who is boss by building a prison and arresting at least 500 people. Uh, arresting innocent people is my favorite game as a child. Uh, jailhouse Blues. Okay, so we need a police station. Government. Police station. That's a lot of crime. Uh, we definitely need the police station. You have to deal with the crime problem, not to arrest people. So we win the election. Our export volume should hopefully be continually improving. Though I would like to uh, left to no exports on board. What what is this? Why is there no exports getting delivered to my ships? This is not something to do with the, the uh, shortage of workers, probably. So you got input? Yeah, it's, it's the input is piling up with the uh, distillery doors. Waiting to be distilled but due to our lack of uh, labor. They're, they're not getting distilled particularly fast. Uh, foreign relations have deteriorated, again. Okay, I now need to start arresting people. Um, you know, over you. Uh, threat level. Oh, I can't can't cycle through the criminals. Um, expect. I'm trying to see if there is a way that I can quickly uh, jump from uh, lists. Yes, it would be in lists. Factions. Job. Criminal. 
It, it doesn't work. I'm gonna have you uh, placed under arrest. Yes. I'm issuing the order. Have the uh, criminal arrested, please. Even though it will uh, slightly, slightly lower respect for me, it will uh, send one criminal to jail. One known criminal is being ordered to jail. Wouldn't run in export logs. Very left no exports on board. Oh, that's because they're delivering most of it to the other, other uh, dock. How much of pay compared to the Caribbean average seller? The criminal's earning $7 an hour. What is this? Coup d'etat. Oh no, the, uh, we're having a military coup. And the loyalists just got beat. Pretty badly. Let me guess, all, all the generals join the uh, coup? Probably. There's one left, that, that's probably all president I only got one guy left. All president he went down. The military's coup has uh, succeeded. Um, well, this this will be a uh, short mission. This is this is how uh, Will Cole 100 uh, fails at building industry. The traitor's army has decided to enter the rule. Always knew giving weapons to a bunch of men in uniforms is a bad idea. Here's your proof. All the valuables are packed, and I am ready to depart when you are in the next five minutes. Uh, well, the number of rebels are growing. Uh, that's not an issue, as seeing as uh, I have been uh, kicked off the island. Uh, well, I have I have lost. So, till next time, this is uh, Will Cole 100. I will uh, reluctantly post this episode so that you can see me failing. Until next time.